What's up cuties? Today I am taking you behind the scenes in a video from my online drum school, DBO Academy. Members there get access to their very own drumming path, live lessons, and new lessons and courses released every single week. And on top of that, I take them behind the scenes in videos like this or in I Prevail's first show of 2022 that we released a couple weeks back. Things get pretty nuts in this one, so let's dive into it. Kind of starting off field rate. Are you? Are you you Today is music video shoot day, and what's in these boxes is very important to said music video. So, what the heck could all these boxes possibly be? Drum heads. But they are not just regular drum heads, these are the Remo Silent Stroke drum heads so they don't make any sound, these are going to be huge for today. So the music video checklist is gonna be drum set, silent drum heads, cymbals, headphones, gaff tape, stuff like that. Let's try not to forget anything here. Here's the situation, people. Emergency music video shoot. So, we're trying to film it in just like one day with basically no planning. Let's see what happens. Guys, this is very exciting because my car just hit 200,000 miles. Just unloaded the kit and just parked in this big yard. Let's see what we're working with here. All right, this is where we're filming today. Basically, massive warehouse type situation. It's kind of like the lights that I have. And then we got the floors all wet for some to like make it reflect. Little projector back here. Now it's time to set up the kit. It's funny because this seems very unglamorous, but we'll see how it turns out. Uh, Dylan is over here because he has kidney stones. Well, just one. He has one kidney stone. Just one. He's gonna be ripping a music video with a. Uh, just a kidney stone, so. The unofficial sixth member of the band. <laughs> we'll see if they make an appearance today. Oh my God, could you imagine? Dylan spent all of yesterday at the hospital, at the emergency room, so. What a trooper. Here we are. Yeah. This is what dreams are made of. This is rock star life right here, dude. DBO online. I so wish that these were real heads right now. <laughs> Be ripping it up, dude. Probably like the highlight of my job. And you sound awesome. <laughs> All right, so for music videos, we got these silent heads. We actually stack the same cymbals so they don't make any noise. You know what I mean? Dave, who are you talking to? Class beat to the Eric. Dang, those sound awesome, the man. I don't got the face. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep. So you take the audio of my roll and then you just put it in when I have one arm out and then they're gonna know it's like, oh, he did the blast speech really fast. So yeah. like, get the audio. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then. Oh, that's sick. One hand behind the back. Just to take one. Spraying water on the ground. Because I like you getting close. But what was happening is like the light was just missing you a little bit. Like that was pretty good, but you were like ju it was yeah, just yeah, about to miss the sweet you. spot. Pearl Kit made it in the shot, baby. Looking pretty good. the risk a little bit. No, I know, absolutely. Like, dude, you gotta get right in there. Yeah, I'm good, man. Oh, no, dude. I mean, it's dope. 
You're doing great, buddy. I'm kind of starting off feel great. Uh-oh. Would you mind telling a little bit of the story of what happened yesterday? But mostly about, about why you have a black eye. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, um, I can definitely see that. So for a little bit of context, I've never been punched in the face, but I really just wanted to not be awake at the hospital, and they weren't giving me any pain meds or anything, and I was waiting in the waiting room for about two and a half hours. So I turned to Eric, who was nice enough to take me to the hospital, and I asked him to punch me and knock me out, and he wouldn't, which is a golden opportunity for him to hit me in the face. So I hit myself in the face really hard, and instead of it knocking me out, I just took the hit, and then the lady running the doctor's office in front just went, hey! <laughs> Just like that, with her hand no out, like that was gonna yourself. do. Yeah, didn't even follow. Just hey, no, no, I mean like, like oh, okay. <laughs> just in this room, all day, baby. I don't know. <laughs> Apparently, our manager locked himself in handcuffs. <laughs> there they are. We got them out. We had to get the cops coming. So far. So far? Sorry for our proud friend here inside. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Just a normal day. Getting out of handcuffs. They didn't even believe the call. Yeah. Like, we're not showing up. I said my dumb friend locked himself in handcuffs. Yeah, they were laughing. Dude, this person laughed. So you have someone detained. <laughs> no. Yeah, no. <laughs> he detained himself. <laughs> Dylan may be passing this kidney stone right now. And we're only like halfway through the shoot. Yikes. So I may have went a little too hard on my performance shots because I kind of broke my snare head and I, this is brand new. Again, we're only halfway through the day, so I, I don't know what we're gonna do about this. All right, so ultimately I taped the original silent stroke to the rim. Hopefully this works and hopefully Dylan is still alive. If you are a drummer and you watch Gabe's like stuff and you haven't signed up, what are you doing? There is a child out there named Jax. He is like seven years old. He's been watching Gabe's videos for the last couple years and he is a maniac. He's amazing. And he's so young and you want to know who he learned from? Gabe Helgera. So if you're out there and you're like a 15 year old or maybe you're 25 or hell, maybe you're 50 and like I can't do this. Gabe taught a five year old. <laughs> so if you can teach a five-year-old, he can teach you. He's a DBR Drum Academy beats online. member. Yeah. What a pitch, man. That was but pretty great. At the same time, it is, it is time to film my Prevail videos. Now put this away. I love the fish eye stuff. I was just it's gonna nice. say. It's just so high energy, man. Nice, right, Steve. Yeah. You thinking about messing around with some candy? Yeah, I cracked open a sucker. Right now my plan is to just eat this sucker. <laughs> Frick is good. <laughs> I mean, yellow's the worst flavor, so this will probably just be like gross. It'll but probably make you stop eating. I'll probably candy. stop eating all the candy together, like all together. Gross. I think just so we all know, I should eat it. You think it just tastes the same? Uh -huh. Oh dang, this one! You want to display with the <laughs> There's just a specific type of like savagery of just the whole thing in one fight, dude. <laughs> you want to see what's inside this one this time? Okay. Yeah, it's a bunch of white stuff. Yeah, that makes sense. Here, I'll show you the same. Yeah, I'll check this one. Yeah. Also white stuff. For the record, I'm just doing this just to, you know, for product and development here. It's <laughs> like awful. <laughs> so we've got the yellow wrapper and the regular wrapper. Yeah, that, that's something. A few moments later. I just shouldn't have ate all that candy. Twelve seconds later. Uh -huh. Things have changed. You're saying this is too many Skittles? <laughs> Steve, was that all of them? 
That's all of them, yeah. Is that not how you eat them? Are you done? Yeah. All right, that is a wrap on the very first music video and the very first song that we've put out in over two or two and a half years. That was a whirlwind. When you're doing music videos, you know, it's like, hey, perform as hard as you can. And as you saw, we had many, many takes. So there's a lot of head banging. I feel it. But yeah, this was an interesting journey to try to come up with something pretty last minute. It's a really good lesson. Dylan ended up surviving. Steve is in a sugar coma now. We'll see what happens to them in the next episode. You can check out the music video on I Prevail's YouTube channel. But thanks again for watching. I'll talk to you soon. See ya.